Google's advice to update Chrome on possible viruses popular posts from this blog an anti-aging protein was identified in a rat sent to the International Space Station Tokyo, November 7, 2020, Monday two years ago, some rats were sent to the Japanese space agency JASCA International Space Station. Several experiments were performed on these mice in which researchers have succeeded in identifying a particular type of protein. It is claimed that this protein will not only help astronauts understand their health problems, but also play an important role in controlling the aging process. According to a source, space travel speeds up the aging process, which will help in understanding the role of this protein in the anti-aging field. According to the researchers, a protein called nuclear factor erythroid-related factor controls part of the biological mutations in mice that are associated with aging. NRF Jani, known as the master regulator of antioxidant response, is associated with increasing and decreasing stress. For the experiment, scientists sent 16 rats to the International Space Station in 2012 on a SpaceX Falcon rocket. Half of them were not gi if your phone has this older Android version, you need to upgrade it New Delhi date. The 11th of November 2020, Wednesday most of the smartphones have Android operating system and the number of Android users is increasing rapidly. While many users are buying new devices and keeping them updated, many users are still using old smartphones and have not updated them. If you are also using a device that has an older Android operating system, you should upgrade your phone's OS. If not here's a new product just for you. Media reports say that smartphones running Android version 7. One or older need to upgrade to the latest software version. Thus it will be necessary to access the internet as before. This has become necessary due to the expiration of the partnership between Certificate Authority Let's Encrypt and Certificate Authority Iden Trust. Out of the total number of Android devices worldwide, 66.2% are working on Android 7. One or earlier. Less than a year as per the information, 33.8% of the existing devices have already started showing certainty. How did Russian hackers manipulate US election results? Ahmedabad, DT, the 2nd of November 2020, Monday the US presidential election is held every four years, on the Tuesday following the first Monday in November. Tomorrow, in the 59th election, American citizens will vote for their president. American investigative agencies are now convinced that in the last election, Russian hackers carried out a very systematic cyber attack on the American electoral system. In addition to Russia this year, China and Iran are also said to be trying to disrupt the American election. Hacking and social media data targeted propaganda These two extremely sharp weapons could be totally reversed if the results of a presidential election in a technologically advanced country like the United States were to be reversed. And the system of airports has also been hacked. To reverse the election four years ago, read a series of details of what happened five years ago. A computer in your office has been hacked by Russian hackers. The FBI has informed the national Twitter will comfortably apologize for showing Ladakh in China. A unique initiative in the banking sector, OP Ahmedabad. The 9th of November 2020, Monday just as we no longer have to go to a bank branch to withdraw money after having a huge network of ATMs of different banks, India has made the unified payments interface, OP, system accessible to both bank branches and ATMs. Every bank now has a mobile app, but OP is different in that it can be used by many other types of apps besides a bank. In addition to special online payment apps, WhatsApp, which is now used by 400 million people in the country every day, has also grown exponentially with the advent of OP, albeit now limited to 20 million people. There are many benefits to online transactions and India has taken the initiative in this direction, which even a tech company like Google or Apple could not do on its own. What exactly is OPI? The Unified Payments Interface OPI, is a system developed by the National Payments Corporation of India. 
With its help, it is possible to exchange money online and instantly between two bank accounts. The Zoom app will feature end-to-end -end encryption Ahmedabad, DT. November 2020, Monday The use of the Zoom app for online education and meetings has grown exponentially in the aftermath of the lockdown, but so far it has lacked one thing, it did not have end-to-end -end encryption. Please support our channel to grow by pressing subscribe button as well as the bell icon for daily science and technology updates. Thank you.